Now we're gonna draw and label suspension bridge, which is a little bit more complicated. So first we pick a segment and draw a nice long a segment across the screen. Then we're gonna pick more tools and find the midpoint. So the midpoint is right here. Okay. Now we're gonna use a polygon to draw a two supporting beams or basically two rectangles the same distance from the midpoint so we count one two three four five and a half one two three four five and a half so we're gonna use the same distance from both uh, uh, sides So we're gonna go. So we're gonna go from the top, which doesn't really matter. And we finish. Good. Now we're gonna use the arch to connect the two supporting beams. You're gonna click on the first point, down to the middle, and back to the top. And then in this side, we're gonna click top, somewhere in the middle, and down to the other side. And then we're gonna continue in the same exact way to the left side. Now, we're gonna draw all the suspensions. We're gonna use a simple segment. And we're gonna put just a few so this, we can see it's a suspension and then same here okay so it's not perfect but looks not too bad you can fix later can fix some of the points make it more straight if you want okay now we're gonna lock the points so we don't move the bridge highlight everything and click lock points if you don't want to see the points you can delete it or hide it so if you click on these points you can hide and make it nice a little bit more clear this is in case if you want a little bit more clean image. Finally, we're gonna measure or find the two triangles. I'm gonna make my own triangles. I'm gonna click on a polygon. And I'm gonna draw one triangle right here inside of the rectangle. And I'm gonna do the same on the other side. I'm gonna go select, click, I'm gonna make both red so I can see and now I'm gonna do the measurement. I'm gonna click on each side and gonna click the label so we wanna make sure this triangle is congruent to the one on the right. We continue on both ends This should be one. Okay, click on in that little segment. Not. Sometimes you have to click right on a point, and if it doesn't work, you click on a. If it doesn't work, you're gonna make an extra segment. gonna click again still doesn't show okay well this should be one as yes, there you go one 
now I'm gonna do the measurement of the angles click on the angle and we do the same way click one two three this number two is always in the middle one two three one two three doing the same thing one two three one two three one two three you can see the angles and the sides are congruent finally the distance of the entire uh, bridge you can measure with a single line segment and if you click on uh, segment label and it'll give you it was 90 which I already gave you halfway so this is the way you can draw a simple uh, suspension bridge.